Well, a wild ride on Wall Street to begin the week. The market starting the day much lower. It's a pattern we have seen over the past several days. Take a look there. But we do welcome our brand new News Nation business correspondent, Marley Caden. Marley, the market started out rough this morning, but how did they close? It was a wild day, like you said, in the markets, Nicole. There is a lot to digest here. So stocks staged a dramatic comeback in the final hours of trading today. The Dow shockingly closed in the green after suffering a more than 1,000-point loss during early trading. At market close, the Dow was up 99 points, marking its first gain in a week. The S&P 500 finished up nearly uh, nearly flat, just 0.3% up, and the Nasdaq closed up nearly 1%. Now take a look at this chart. This is the Dow's trading activity for the day. It looks like a roller coaster. We opened the day at 33,070. By 1225 this afternoon, we had fallen to 33,150. And by close, we had bounced our way all the way back up to 34,364. We were expecting to talk about a sea of red based on this morning's trading, but that all changed as investors stepped in to buy up those battered tech shares. The tech sell-off has been happening all month in anticipation that the Federal Reserve will soon tighten its monetary policy through interest rate heights to combat inflation. Now, of course, everybody wants to know why is this happening? And it's for a variety of reasons. Today's movement was primarily investors taking advantage of the massive stock sell-off that's been happening this month. So much so that Facebook, Amazon, and Microsoft all rebounded to end the day in the green. The Federal Reserve meeting this Tuesday and Wednesday is another major drive that has been weighing down the markets. Additionally, the geopolitical concerns about the situation at the Ukrainian border are impacting market volatility, as well as investors waiting for earnings from some of the stock market giants, like Apple, Microsoft, Tesla, IBM, and Caterpillar, to name just a few. It is certainly poised to be an interesting week in the markets, Nicole. Yeah, absolutely. Very rough start. At least there was a rebound that helped things. Thank you so much, Marley. And of course, we welcome you here to News Nation. Thank you. Thank you for watching. Click the red subscribe button below so you can get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.